Hello and welcome back to the channel and now you join me for this week's treasure hunt which is called Tropical Fruits. Now the clue for this one says carting on electric wheels is five times better if you have the skill. So this wants you to use an electric vehicle to smash carts five times. Now the car in the image is of course one of the uh, new Extreme E vehicles. So I'm not sure if it works with any electric vehicle but we're going to go ahead and quickly win one of the Extreme E ones. Now, there are two ways you can win it, one of which is a seasonal championship, the other way is by completing this Broadwalk Danger Sign, in which it wants you to use an S1 class vehicle, so I'm using the Ford Bronco for this one, and it wants you to get a target of about, I think it's 430 feet. Now this is quite easy to do, and it's obviously a lot quicker than doing the seasonal championship, but you'll eventually do both anyway, but this is just in order for us to complete this week's treasure hunt as quickly as possible. So as you can see there, we smashed the required target, and that's the seasonal objective to complete. So we've now won the number 44 Extreme E vehicle, as you can see here. Now we need to use this to smash five carts. So in order to do this, we're at Player Azul. So just to the left of the Goliath race, you will see an XP board. Now here is the equivalent to basically a market square, and there are loads and loads of carts dotted around uh, this entire square. There's more than five of them. So as you can see here, there's a couple just on this corner. And the second you smash one, you'll get the cartwheels uh, skill pop up. Now you effectively need to get this five times. If you smash a cart too quickly after the first one, you won't get the skill pop up. So you have to sort of wait a minute before you go ahead and smash your next one, etc, etc. Now, if you end up smashing them all and you don't have five of them, what you can do is go into Horizon Solo, and then once you've smashed one and you've got the skill, you can then hit the rewind button and keep going back. If you go back about two steps and then restart and smash it again, you'll see the skill pop up. And you can keep on doing this with the same cart until you obviously get the treasure box unlocked. Now I had to do this about six times because I think these treasure hunts are still slightly glitched but it did work in the end. Now like I said I'm not sure if you can use any electric vehicle but the one in the image was an extreme E one which is why I picked it. Now the treasure box itself is actually located behind your one of the player owned houses in player azure just off the beach uh, by a boat on a broken down pier. So this is it on the map as you can see sort of just uh, southeast of the house there and that is this week's treasure hunt complete now like i said i don't know if you can use any electric vehicle or it has to be an extreme e1 but i played it on the safe side and used the extreme e1 but uh to do the broadwalk danger sign and win the extreme e car is super easy now if you are struggling with anything of course please do let me know down below in the comments i'm more than happy to help you guys out as best as i can um, I do still have my Forza Thumb Guide and Photo Challenge Guide coming out shortly as well if you need help with them, so stick around for those. Um, but anyway, if it did help you out, I'd very much appreciate if you could drop a like. And if you're new to the channel, subscribe and massively helps me out as well. But apart from that, folks, I want to wish you all the best. Make sure you stay safe and take care.